The challenging period in my life, particularly, I can think about, I had cancer uh, five years ago, and the thought of not being able to play football again, which was kind of a realistic possibility at one point, they said, you will never be the same again, you won't be able to do the things you did before. The thought of losing football was kind of the drive that from day one, when I was told I had cancer, that I thought I'm already in recovery. When I was younger, I, I grew up on an estate, um, and on an estate, you just, it's the mentality you get caught in that kind of zone where you're just locked into that area. Um, and I used football as a way out for, for me, really. I used to think my connection to football was about my city and my culture and my people. Newcastle, my grandfather, my father, my roots. I've realised how much more it is than that. For some people, it's been a lifeline. For some people, it saved their lives. It spiralled into something so much more than kicking a ball on the pitch. Sometimes you're almost like, oh, I don't even want to care so much. But it's almost impossible not to. Football has this weird thing. As much as you try, you can't put into words the weight and the significance that football has in people's lives. It's got me through a couple sexual assaults. Whether I'm on my own with a couple mates, I knew that I could just smash the ball around and get rid of that sort of that anger and the resentment. I've been um, diagnosed recently with ADHD. Apparently it's like a dopamine deficit. So if I wasn't playing football, but, you know, twitching and then afterwards it's like nothing, I can concentrate. There was a time in my life as well due to work that I had mental health problems like anxieties caused by work. And being Greek, I could never like understand that it's a fact because we don't accept that mental health is an issue in Greece. It turned out to be like anxiety, and the only thing that basically was bringing balance in my head at that period of time was playing football. It's a whole community, it's a whole essence, it's a whole vibe that's beyond just the 90 minutes. It's almost like having a second family. Football holds that same sort of love in my heart, and I don't know where I'd be without it. I think if I didn't find football, and find that way out, I probably wouldn't be on the journey I am now. We live and breathe it, it's very much part of our life and our culture.